Carter is preparing for his next fight in the UFC against Isis Kudo, 9-5 in mixed martial arts at 79 overall, and he's pretty much good across the board. Now, we're boosting up our attributes here. We're trying to make sure that our ground game, kind of our body, our health, our stamina, all that stuff is on point. But look what Dana White has to say. Hey, kid, congratulations. You've been winning fights, gaining fans, and if you win your next fight, I'll guarantee you a spot on a main event card on pay-per-view. So wait, 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 wait. Dana White is promising that if we beat this dude, we get a shot at a pay-per-view main card. No longer being on the undercard, we're gonna move it in the upper echelon of fighters being on a main card. You can see we're 10-0. I feel like we deserve it. We've been destroying opponents. We've had a few close fights, but we want to make sure we do some quick work of Isis Kudo today and we don't let him get any chance to beat us. Because you know what? We have a lot on the line. This is huge for us. If we get that pay-per-view main card, we'll be sitting pretty, but oh no. Carter's in a bad situation here. Kudo has parried him, got him on the ground. Carter is not blocking. What are you doing, Carter? You're getting destroyed, but he finds a way to stand up there. Now, on her feet, Carter's trying to make him pay. Nice Superman punch. He's got Kudo stamina low. Kudo looks hurt. He's retreating. But Carter doesn't seem to he can land the nice punch there. Good kick, but it wasn't enough to actually drop him there. So, 20 seconds left here in round number two. Kudo so far has kind of dominated this one. He's taken us down a few times. We need something here, and Carter gets taken down. This is a horrible way to end round number two. I think Carter won round number one. Round number two, though, seems to be all Kudo. He had multiple takedowns. He finished that round with us being on our back. So I feel like the judges are leaning towards him. If I had to guess, it's a 1-1 split after two rounds. So round number three is coming up. We have to make sure we're on top of our game, that we deliver some devastating punches and knock this dude out. So into round number three, Carter looking for something. Being on the offensive, good kick to the face. Kudo's retreating, but he gets a nice kick to Carter in the face, parries him, and delivers another good punch. The spinning back kick lands. Carter's got to be better than this. And look at what Kudo's doing. He's smart. He knows that if he stands up with Carter, he's probably not going to win, so he takes us to the mat. But Carter, quick to get back up on his feet. Now, two nice kicks to the face there. Kudo looks hurt. You can tell he's rocked a little bit. He's retreating. Here's, here's the biggest thing. We cannot lose to a man in a ponytail. I refuse to lose to a dude that has a braided ponytail. That's rule number one in the UFC. Don't lose to a man with a braided ponytail. So 30 seconds left. He goes for a ridiculous kick. Carter is able to parry that one, though. Nice punches. He's rocked. Come on, Carter. Good punches again. The left hook's coming the right straight. Another left hook. He parries it, though. He looks hurt. Finish the fight, Carter. What a punch. Absolutely destroys Kudo there. Our signature punch, the Superman punch, lights him up, drops him. We finish it. Carter goes on top of the cage to celebrate. It's a huge victory. Look how bloody Kudo is. Round number three was definitely ours. We had an opportunity to knock him out, and we showed him we're not going to lose to a dude with a braided ponytail. That's just against the rules at this point. So we go to the judges, obviously. Carter's going to win by a knockout here. And Dana White, we did what you asked us to. Can we have that pay-per-view shot? So looking at that, Souza beats Rockhold in the main title card. Uh, you can see Carter does pretty well there, but our next opponent looks like Kimbo Slice. I mean, maybe I'm wrong here, maybe his beard isn't big enough, but that dude kind of looks like Kimbo Slice. So we've got some attribute points we can hear, uh, do here. We've got 84 overall for our blocking so far, getting our movement up because we looked a little sluggish there. Got to get the endurance up to a 90, that's our main cap. But I'm feeling pretty good about where Carter is in terms of his fighting skills. This dude, though, looks like Kimbo. He's 5'7", 142, so nowhere near as big as Kimbo. He's got a crazy tattoo on his chest. But look how amped up Carter looks. I haven't seen him this excited for a fight. He's got a chance to show the world what he can do. He's on a main card in a UFC pay-per-view. Let's see what he can do. But this dude, throwing punches. And look, he, wa he must have watched the last fight Carter was in. But look at that slam. Unbelievable. This dude is crazy strong. He must have watched what Kudo did all last match because he took Carter to the mat almost immediately here in the first round. Now, Carter, defense is slacking at this point. He's in a bad spot. Can he get up? This guy is looking to submit him here. Carter's trying to roll out of it. Carter rolls out of it now, and he's able to stand up. That's exactly what we needed him to do. Now, round number one, about two minutes left. Again, this guy is still on the offensive. Carter is trying to pick his shots, but he rattles him with that uppercut. Finished him, Carter. He drops him. Could this be the end of the fight? Finish this, Carter. But good defense there by Miller, a.k.a. Kimbo Slice Jr. So Carter's trying to stand back up with him, and he's getting hit in the face a few times here. Nice kick. You can see he's still rocked with that red indicator on his head says that he's still in trouble. Carter with another kick to the face. Good blocking. Misses on a nasty upgrade. This guy is throwing haymakers. I feel like his stamina has to be depleting at some point. So round number one, I'm pretty sure he's going to be won by Carter after that good knockdown. Going into round number two, though, it's more of the same for Miller. He has us on the mat again. 
He's trying to destroy us. And look at this. He's he's posturing up. Carter gets his way out of it, though. He's able to stand back up. Good hook there by Carter. The uppercuts are... Oh, my God. He dropped Carter. Carter's in trouble. Please recover, Carter. You cannot lose. You're 11-0. You need this 12th win. Dana White just gave you a big shot. You cannot choke. We have the biggest opportunity of your career at this point. So in the back posture, Carter trying to spin out of this one. It's not looking good so far. Don't want to get submitted, though. Carter is able to push up again and stand up. So with a minute 40 left, Carter needs something big here. Not a good look after getting dropped early. And he destroys him. Miller is down again. Carter's trying to finish the fight. A minute 25 left. But Miller is able to regain consciousness and pushes Carter out. The second round is coming to a close. Carter's able to get a nice kick there. Round number two is going to end. That felt like kind of anybody's round there. Carter did have the latest knockout, though, which may benefit him, but it could be a little bit of rocky at this point. We have to make sure that going in round number three, we leave no chance for the judges to tell us that this isn't our fight. So round number three is about to start. It's the biggest round of Carter King's career. Can we win, or will we choke in our biggest opportunity? Now this guy still is. Look at all these haymakers he's throwing, all these uppercuts. Carter's able to land two nice kicks, a third kick to the face. Miller's looking a little sluggish. He misses on that takedown. Carter's taking those legs out because we want to make sure that he's not able to move. A good haymaker there. Gets parry, but he blocks that one quickly. Carter's missing on that knee. Missing on the knee again. That move's not going to work, Carter. Nice kick to the lower body. 43 seconds left. Carter's trying to finish this fight. It's been an even round so far in round number three. The Superman punch lands. Look at how aggressive Miller is, though. Carter with a good, nice three-punch combo. Nice uppercut again. Finish this, Carter. Nice kick to the face. Superman punch hits him. He's down, people. Can Carter finish it? He might be down. With under 20 seconds left, Carter comes through and destroys him. His face is beat up, but look how excited he is. He just won on his first pay-per-view main card. Superman punch destroys him. He falls against the cage. Carter gets him one last punch to the ground, and that is going to be Carter's 12th victory in the UFC. He is an undefeated fighter. Dana White, give him a title shot at this point. No one has been able to stop Carter so far. He's been a train just running through competition. Those Anjos wins there. But honestly, when is Dana White going to give us a title shot? I feel like Carter deserves it. Thanks for watching today's video. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. Hit the like button to share your support. And I'll see you guys in the next one.